my name is Zhuo Qi. I'm from Hunan, China. Right now, I am a first-year PhD statistics student in KAUST. Two years ago, I came to KAUST and uh, I came here to be a master's student. So let's start with why I chose KAUST as my master's school first. Uh, when I was still a senior student in university, I decided to apply for some university abroad because I want to experience more possibilities in life. I read some news about KAUST online coincidentally, and then I realized uh, there's a university in Saudi Arabia which provides a very well-known professors and full scholarships. That's it, that's how I came to KAUST. In the last two years, I took so many courses about statistics, applied mathematics, and uh, computer science. In fact, my bachelor degree is economics and math, so statistics is really kind of fresh for me. And uh, when I just came here, I told my professor that I was not familiar with the coding of R and uh, for so many statistical theories, but my professor Mark Jenton, he really gave me a lot of instructions and uh, encouragement in my research and uh, life. But my research is mainly about multivariate functional data. For us, normally the data is just about some point. For example, uh, the temperature today like is 35 degrees or what. And the functional data we are analyzing is not only the data um, today, but we will see what's the temperature for every hour today. So it's like the temperature from zero hour to 24 hours um, of today. So it's not only a point, it will be a curve of time. So this is difference and this is the subject that we are analyzing. Uh, and what I am analyzing is not only functional, but multivariate functional. So it means if I don't only collect the temperature data, but I also collect the precipitation data. So it's like I got um, two variables. These are not only uh, univariate. Uh, what I am analyzing is how they correlate each other and how I can make use of some for example, even precipitation data, I can get more about the temperature. So um, what I'm going to solve is right now in the real life, there are so many imperfections about the data. Some data might be missing and some data might be too extremes. Statistically, we say it's outliers. It might be because of uh, the equipment of the temperature, like uh, they might be sensitive to the environment they are exposed to or there are some kind of like artificial errors so which will makes the data not that perfect some of them will be missing and some of them will be extreme they cannot reflect the real data my model will be not that influenced by this uh, imperfection case and I can still make use of this data well to predict for example what will be the temperature in the future but it's a functional case so it will be a curve not only uh, one data. I think what I got in cost in the last two years um, is so much. I hope you can join us if you are interested in research and if you are interested in cost. This is not only a university but a community also because it provides you everything that you can imagine in life, in research, like we have very well-known professors and you can make so many friends and uh, uh, Saudi Arabia it's so different. Um, the culture is very unique and uh, as long as you are curious and uh, uh, you want to explore more, uh, we welcome you to be a part of us and to write your own stories in cost.